you've been on the carpet? What do you notice is new on your desk that wasn't there when you left your desk? You can say it out. What's there? Sticky notes. Yes, and there are two sticky notes, and you're going to use them both. So you can, like, check them out, and then I want you to take your hands off them. So sticky notes home. When I say home, that means they're on your desk and your hands are off. But you are going to get to use those sticky notes to take notes about her point of view. What is our main character thinking about the situation? You're going to get to put your wisdom onto these notes. Okay? So the title of our story is Soccer Friends. And what I would like you to do while I'm reading is I'd like you to read along with me silently. And that means you're following along, you're looking at the words, as, and you're hearing me say them, and your eyes are looking at them, and you're reading silently. Okay? So when you read with your eyes and you listen with your ears, that helps you become a better reader. True. So I'm going to start reading, and I'm going to pause from time to time, and we're going to do some tasks. Okay? Let's figure out what problem this girl has on the field. Soccer friend. Kelly couldn't wait until soccer season began. She could not be patient because she just loved racing to get the ball. She would use her imagination to picture the ball and then she would fly toward it. Kelly practiced at home during the calm, peaceful mornings. So I have a question for you about that first or you have wonders when you're reading and you're not really sure, we reread again. So good read, good readers read over and over and over again. So this time I'd like you to start at the beginning with Kelly and you're going to read that first paragraph with me out loud. Let's, there's one sentence in here that tells you what she really loves to do in soccer. Let's read out loud. Kelly couldn't wait until soccer season began. She could not be patient because she just loved racing to get the ball. She could use her imagination to picture the ball. And then she would fly toward it. Kelly practiced at home during the calm, peaceful morning. Now, turn and tell someone next to you, what was it that she really loved about soccer? Oh, I what was her favorite part of soccer? Can you find that in the text? 